The following contest is a Hell in a Cell match. Making his way to the ring from Las Vegas, Nevada, weighing in at 235 pounds, Chris Bay. Ever since I took my... And his opponent from Buffalo, New York, weighing in at 247 pounds, the world's heavyweight champion, Cook. Everyone in this match is... It's the structure that's going to make the difference in this one, folks. These superstars can act all nonchalant all they want, but when you see that structure and the door slams behind you, I don't care who you are, you shudder inside. Oh, no argument there, Corey. That's why there have been so few WWE superstars who have ever had the guts to step inside the structure for a Hell in a Cell match. The thing that makes this so much more insidious than a simple cage match is there's no escape. The door is padlocked, and the only way out is by pinfall or submission. Or by stretcher, maybe. There's always that. And now the most dangerous area inside the cell. Yeah. Oh! Fishing for something beneath the ring. A baseball bat? With a weapon like that in play, this is not going to be good. Coming back into the ring, back to the action. Into the corner. This can't be good. It's deep, but I don't think it's playable. Moved at the right time. Look at this. Going counter for counter. Reversal on top of reversal. Effectively targeting the arm. He avoids the damage. Impossible to prepare for Hell on Earth, but Chris is the way to come up on top in this one. You gotta do things you never thought you'd have to do before, that you never wanted to do before, because this is an environment like no other. The competitors must channel a primitive, barbaric version of themselves. Oh my goodness, what an impactful STO! Punch right in the head. Standing drop kick. What else? Way to steer clear. He saw it coming, taking advantage. Set crashing to the floor. Out of the ring and even closer to the chain link enclosure. And they have done their best not to let this structure affect them too greatly. Superstars are taking it above anyone's expectations. 
proven hell doesn't need to stay in the confines. Trapping their opponent's arm. Crossface submission is in. It's a wrap. He's got it locked in. He may not have a choice. He may have to tap out. It is locked in way too tight. There is no escape. this arena as war is waged on top of the cell. Ooh. Able to sidestep it. This is beyond dangerous. This is more than reckless. No one should be up there, let alone performing these maneuvers. Oh, 
Restraining that trapezius muscle. This won't win the match, but it's one way to inflict a great deal of punishment on an opponent. It's a roundabout strategy, but it might work. Look at this, he let it go. Curious decision there, Michael. And he's able to counter. Making that shoulder a priority. Do you hear the WWE rumors? They are ravenous for these gladiators who are putting life and limb on the line right now. scenario in which he doesn't end up feeling that fall for a long time. This is rather reckless of him, wouldn't you say? This whole match is reckless, but necessary. He has summited the cell. But will the reward be worth the risk? Look at him totally vibing with the WWE Universe right now. German suplex, and not done yet. Another German, and continuing to punish the opponent with a German. Now the time to capitalize. Vital 
stage in this matchup, and this audience is fully aware of it. Yeah, they know another turning point can come at any second, and that can be the instant that ends it all. Oof. Warm up the engine on the ambulance. I got a very bad feeling about where these competitors are going to end up soon. Great win with the ball on the counter. Ah, look at this. Saxton, I don't think they're completely aware of their surroundings. They just have tunnel vision for each other. A sequence of reversals there. A series of reversals. Quick exchange of counters there. The target's been acquired once more. Down on the neck with reckless abandon. This one is all but over. Rip it at the eyes. We knew it. He's looking for yet another exclamation mark. You can't survive any more of those. Gets him with a gut wrench suplex. What impact. Able 
Oh, to a foot. Change his career forever, Cole, and frankly, it'll probably change mine. All right, then. Guess this madman's climbing up the cell. Can't have anything good in store with that strategy. He's got something in mind here. I don't think I want to know what it is. Remember, though, what goes up must come down, and sometimes it's the coming down part that gets you. He's reached the top. Now what? I shut the thing. Do it. Ooh. Guys, we can see the top of the city. Somebody has got to get them down before things go south in a hurry. That shoulder targeted there. His whole arena is standing watching these maniacs battle it out 25 feet above the ground. Four on Shifts it back onto him. And another cover. Put him at the button. We've already seen part of the set break apart. Proving hell doesn't need to stay in the confines of the cell. Hell can go anywhere. Stop it. Saxton, just look at Will it be? One, two, three. How in the world? Incredible to think. After everything we've witnessed, we are still at a stalemate. Insuring back. Oh, oh, right <laughs> Fighting back with a counter. These two shots. That shoulder targeted there. I think we know what's coming next. Oh, cross jacket submission. Sinked in deep. Night, night. Oh, this 
one's over. Tap out! Yes, able to survive and pull through. That match is worth another look. Here we go. celebrate, let alone stand after a match like that. Talk about resilience. Talk about in... The following contest is a Hell in a Cell match. Making his way to the ring from Reno, Nevada. Weighing in at 200 pounds, Carl Ted Rick. This guy. And his opponent from Auckland, New Zealand, weighing in at 210 pounds, Aaron Ken Barry. What type of approach does a superstar need in order to win a matchup like this, Corey? It's important to remember that you can't win a match like this on emotion alone. You have to devise a plan and execute it. Once locked in the cell, we've seen superstars embrace a new, sadistic level of barbaric behavior. I agree, Meyer, and it's all out of necessity. Now on the outside, right by those cell walls. Oh, boy, come on, not the chair. And this match will head back to the ring. Uh-oh. Suplex. Lights out. Face first with a waist lock takedown. Delivers the knee. He gets out of the way. Nice takedown. such a demonic structure that exists solely for pain and suffering. Corey, I have to know, is there any use in coming up with a game plan for this match, or do you have to play it all by ear? Well, absolutely play it by ear, Cole. You know how they say that everyone's going to play until they get hit in the mouth? Well, everyone's going to play it until they enter that cell. And these attacks are spelling nothing but trouble. And we might be seeing a competitor crumbling before our very eyes. Jory, you're he an uppercut. Turn your skin red. Go behind. Into the corner. Into the pin attempt. Kicks out on the pinfall attempt. I didn't think this match was close to over. Oh, God, that hurt. He's lost some of his win now.
making that shoulder vulnerable. Certainly sending a message, getting his shoulder up before two. Oh, Kick lands. He moves just in time. Oh, impressive counter. Great reversal. There it is. Take things into the ring. 
Climbing up top, he's got big plans. You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a position he from way up the double axe handle. Uh-oh. Effectively targeting the arm. see him tap out. Not like this. Oh, uh, just slipped underneath. And just like that, he's out of the hole. Yes. Nothing fancy here. This crowd is feeling is palpable. They are and finds a counter. Sequence of reversals there. Oh man. Heading 
back to the ring. Reversal. Can they go on the attack? Locked in tight, nowhere to go, no escape. This could be the end. There's no way he survives this. No way. And he releases the hold. I don't think he had it fully locked in. Reversal. Can he take advantage? foot in this Hell in a Cell match. Let's take another look, guys. Here is your winner, Aaron Ken Barry. Got to hand it to our winner, standing tall with their arm raised tonight. They really put